This is your 3-minute radiation fallout forecast for the weekend of April 6, 2012. In Canada, light to moderate rain is forecasted for southern Saskatchewan and north of Quebec City. Water vapor analysis and jet stream forecasts identifies the area of highest concern as southern Saskatchewan from Saskatoon south to the U.S.-Canadian border. Vancouver may see rain Friday p.m. and should consider any precipitation as high risk as well. In the U.S., IntelliCast radar shows rain-snow mix across the northwest, including Montana and the Dakotas. As jet stream and troposphere coincide with this area, it should be considered high risk as well as any rainfall on the west coast of California over the weekend. The rain in the Carolinas and South Florida is moving offshore. In Europe, there are several issues in Europe that are ongoing besides the fallout risk from Fukushima. A French reactor on the north coast had two fires in the past two days. The methane well in the North Sea continues to release large clouds of methane gas and will probably be an ongoing problem for several months. As a large portion of Europe is expecting rain over the next 72 hours, it is advisable to treat all precipitation as high risk, and this is especially important for the areas of the southern UK and London as well as France, Germany, Belgium, and the Netherlands, which are in the direct path of the well emissions and water vapor loops through the weekend. Nuke Report The BBC is reporting the Penley reactor fire in France is extinguished. The NRC event page in the U.S. has the following problems listed. Fort Calhoun, Nebraska. 21 out of 101 emergency sirens are malfunctioning again. Oconee, South Carolina. The plant is in standby as a worsening coolant leak is repaired. The plant is currently in an unanalyzed condition that significantly degrades plant safety. This applies to Reactor 2. It's a significant concern and should be covered by local media. In Farley, Alabama. An operator mistakenly failed to start a diesel generator during a surveillance test. The unit is currently refueling. And in Catawba, South Carolina, an emergency was declared from an unusual event due to dual unit loss of off-site power. Note, this is the second serious condition on the same day in South Carolina from two different plants. If you have a safety or security concern or are a reporter covering these stories for local news, please call the NRC at 800-695-7403. You may check the status of these plants at the NRC event notification page on the Internet. Next week, Nuked Radio will continue on Tuesdays and Thursdays from 12 to 1 Eastern Standard Time. Please join us and the other hosts on Orion if you want to know the real news. This message has been brought to you by Radchick and the Orion Talk Radio Network. We care about you because your government doesn't. Stay safe.